N96 is the top model of Nokia. 5 megapixel phone with dual slider design, similar to the N95. Here we have the new design language of Nokia. Piano black finish, rounded corners. Here we have media keys, but once the upper slider is open, they are hidden. On the other slider are the numeric keypads for dialing a number or entering text, but it is flat just as the other one. On the back is the 5 megapixel camera, which unfortunately doesn't have xenon flash, but just LED. Here is the kickstand, used to put the phone horizontally for watching TV, for example, as DVB-H is present. The N78 is a candy bar phone with a design once again resembling the N81. The successor of the N73 still has a 3 megapixel camera, but now adds Wi-Fi support and built-in GPS. It is a multimedia mass model and it is equipped with FM tuner and transmitter. This is the Nokia 6220 Classic, a new 5 megapixel camera phone with Xenon flash, Carl Zeiss lens and autofocus. It is rather strange it's not of the N series, but this shows Nokia's attempt to bring high-end features into mass market phone. The design language is not the one of the N series, but another one found in phones such as the 6210 Navigator with LED for the GPS activity. As other Nokias, this one runs on the feature pack 2 of the operating system, which has a few improvements. Vertical option for the standby screen, horizontal tasks list, and transitions when changing the menus. As you can see, the 6210 has the same design language as the 6220, but this one has the slider phone factor. Here again is the GPS sign, but this phone is the first with integrated compass, which is handy for pedestrian navigation mode. The operating system is the same as in the other models.